from the lands of the Anishinaabe to the Atawantaron, the Haudenosaunee and the Métis. The lands surrounding the Great Lakes are steeped with indigenous history. We acknowledge and thank the Mississaugas of the Credit First Nation for being stewards of this territory. We acknowledge with respect the history, spirituality, and culture of the indigenous peoples with whom the Upper Canada Treaties were signed and the territory wherein our church resides and our responsibility as treaty members. We also honor the heritage and gifts of Métis people. May our actions be guided by our commitment to reconciliation. O God, let our mouth proclaim your praise and your glory all the day long. You send forth your spirit and renew the face of the earth. Glory to the holy and undivided Trinity, one God, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Ah, you who join house to house, who add field to field, until there is room for no one but you, and you are left to live alone in the midst of the land. The Lord of hosts has sworn in my hearing. Surely many houses shall be desolate, large and beautiful houses without inhabitant. For ten acres of vineyard shall yield but one bath, and a homer of seed shall yield a mere ephah. Ah, you who rise early in the morning in pursuit of strong drink, who linger in the evening to be inflamed by wine, whose feasts consist of lyre and harp, tambourine and flute and wine, do not regard the deeds of the Lord or see the work of his hands. Ah, you who drag iniquity along with the cords of falsehood, who drag sin along as with cart ropes, who say, let him make haste, let him speed his work, that we may see it. Let the plan of the Holy One of Israel hasten to fulfillment, that we may know it. Ah, you who call evil good and good evil, who put on darkness for light and light for darkness, who put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Ah, you are wise in your own eyes and shrewd in your own sight. Ah, you who are heroes in drinking wine and valiant at mixing drink, who acquit the the guilty for a bribe, and deprive the innocent of their rights.
trust in the Lord with all your heart, and be not wise in your own sight. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and be not wise in your own sight. In all your ways acknowledge the Lord, who will make straight your paths. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and be not wise in your own sight. Happy are those who find wisdom, and those who get understanding. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and be not wise in your own sight. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. This is the first and great commandment. The second is like it. Love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. O God of our salvation, guard and direct your church in the way of unity, service, and praise. God, our strength, hear our prayer. Give to all nations an awareness of the unity of the human family. God, our strength, hear our prayer. Cleanse our hearts of prejudice and selfishness and inspire us to hunger and thirst for what is right. God, our strength, hear our prayer. Teach us to use your creation for your greater praise so that all may share the good things you provide. God, our strength, Hear our prayer. Strengthen all who give their energy or skill for the healing of those who are sick in body or in mind. God, our strength, hear our prayer. Set free all who are bound by fear and despair. God, our strength, Hear our prayer. Grant a peaceful end and eternal rest to all who are dying and your comfort to those who mourn. God, our strength, hear our prayer. Eternal God, you create us by your power and redeem us by your love. Guide and strengthen us by your Spirit, so that we may give ourselves today in love and service to one another and to you, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Gathering our prayers and praises into one, let us pray as our Savior taught us. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. 
Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. May the Spirit kindle in us the fire of God's love. Amen.